In this video, we're going to be looking at Sakai and a re relatively new tool called Lessons. It was called Lesson Builder, and now it's just called Lessons. Same tool, different name. And what Lessons allow you to do is to consolidate a bunch of different tools and instructions, videos, photos, anything you can do in Sakai onto one page. This is especially helpful for hybrid and online courses. You could also use it in a regular site for a face-to-face -face course as a way to organize material for the student. So instead of a student having to jump from resources to tests and quizzes to assignments and then down to the forums tool and so forth, they just have to look at this one page and it has step-by-step -step and in order what that student needs to do for that week or unit. So we're going to go over to a different site that does not have Lesson Builder in it yet, and I'll show you how to add that tool and how to get started. So if you go under Site Info and go to Edit Tools, you'll see the list of tools available in Sakai, and we need the one called Lessons. Then hit Continue. Now you can name this whatever you want. I'm going to call mine Week 1 because I'm going to order mine in weeks, but you can call yours whatever you like. It also gives you the opportunity to set up more than one unit or week at a time. I'm just going to start with this one, though. Hit Continue and then Finish. Now you'll see it puts it at the bottom down here. So week one is here. We can reorder that later. When you have a new Lesson Builder page, this is what you see. You see a sample page, and it has some really great tips on here on how to get started. So we're going to go through each of these different tools that are listed on here and some that aren't to show you the full functionality of Lessons.